portraits that seem to be from another era. Models set up as if in paintings. <laughs> Fashion photos using clothes made of paper and cardboard. Swiss photographer Christian Tagliavini creates the clothing himself, a time-consuming task. He usually spends several months preparing for one photo shoot. I'm fascinated by the fact that I don't simply release the shutter, but that the real fun for me is before I take the pictures. I say that I'm not really a photographer, but a workman of photography. I like to play at designing and create clothes no one can really wear. Like in the photo series Dame di Cartone, or Women of Cardboard from 2008, the designs were inspired by Baroque styles, by Cubism, and by the fashions of the 1950s. For earlier works, Tagliavini had the clothes tailor-made, but here he opted for cardboard. A seamstress said to me, this fabric is not good, it's too stiff, like cardboard. So, I got the idea of just making clothes from cardboard. I liked the flat, stiff cardboard clothes in connection with the three-dimensionality of the models. Tagliavini is currently working on a series using motifs from playing cards. The 41-year-old originally studied mechanical science. He taught himself photography and graphic design. He does almost everything himself, including making the wooden frames for the playing card pictures. But he has laser specialists precisely cut out the costumes he's designed in paper and cardboard. Tagliavini experiments with several drafts before deciding on one. Working with a model is just one small part of the process. I'm looking for perfection, and that's not easy. When I take a photo, I'm never satisfied, and I want to do it again because I try to devote the greatest attention to every detail. It can take two, three, or even five weeks before I have a single photo. Christian Tagliavini released his first photographic work six years ago. It was a photo series with an overriding concept, such as chromophobia or fear of color or Aspetando Freud, waiting for Freud. His greatest success to date was the portrait series 1503, which he did two years ago. Photos made to look like old master paintings. Here he used fabric as well as cardboard. He got inspiration for his own designs from the Italian Renaissance painter Il Bronzino. I wanted to recreate the atmosphere of the Renaissance with the combination of the style and artful textiles of the period. But I didn't want to simply imitate the paintings of the Renaissance, but to give the photos my very own style. In 2011, Christian Tagliavini exhibited his Renaissance photos in Paris, Milan, Utrecht and London. And in Chiasso, Switzerland, where he lives, he's had his first retrospective exhibition. In early 2012, Tagliavini won an internationally significant prize for photography, the Hasselblad Masters Award in the category of fine art. The Swiss photographer is now able to make a living from his art and finance the months of preparatory work. The costumes in his latest series are again made of paper and cardboard, but have no historical references. I cast an ironic gaze at fashion, especially in my new series. Here I feel even more like a fashion designer and photographer, and allow my ideas free reign. So far, only two of the planned playing card photos have been completed. The series is still untitled, and creating it will probably take Christian Tagliavini all year, given the precise way he works.